Becker has the ball set how he wants it. And we're just about ready to kick this game off, folks. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. They'll bring him down right around the 38-yard line. Super effort by the tailback to pick up a nice gain in a first down. He's really a good-looking ball carrier. From their own 38-yard line, it's first down. They'll go with the run once again. Makes it out to about the 49. And the delayed handoff works for a big game. Got to be happy with the effort there by your tailback. And down he goes, right around the 46-yard line. That play was over before it got started. That was just a case of the offensive line getting beat at the snap of the ball. Second and 13. Ball on the 46-yard line. Strike to his receiver, no good. That one sailed on him. He wanted his receiver, but I think that may have slipped out of his hands. intercepted and that'll bring up a punting situation yeah they just couldn't connect on the pass there that was a very good stand by this defense Tyson will be the return man he'll take it from the 18 and he just got drilled the Buffaloes right now, Kirk, I think they've just got to play within themselves. Sometimes you get at home and you get just a little bit too fired up at the beginning of a game. I agree with you. I think sometimes there's a tendency for certain teams to press a little bit because they're trying so hard to keep this home crowd in the game and they've been waiting all week and they're so excited. Sometimes you force a play. Let's let the play naturally come to you and react to it. So we'll see if this team playing at home jumps the gun a little bit or if they just let the game come to them. Second and nine. Ball on the 25. Hauls it in as he's pushed out of bounds. I like the call here by the defense to bring the heat with the outside linebacker. It was just a better call by the offense, and that's why it's a first down. Misdirection handoff. Second down and seven. Ball on their own 43. Edwards, the ball carrier. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. Wants to go long and does. In and out of his hands. And they're coming after this punter. He punts it away, and it's a great kick. He's tackled at the 27-yard line. Every drive's important in a tie game. I look for both sides to come out with some urgency. Throws the screen, almost going the other way on that one. Boy, Brad, this guy drops an interception. And what's ironic about that from going to the meetings the other day is that this guy's been telling the coaches he wants to play some wide receiver. 
You wonder why you're not playing wide receiver? Because you can't catch the ball as a defensive back. Tackle made around the 38-yard line. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 38. And he's tackled right away. Brought down around the 45-yard line. From the 45-yard line, first down. Just throws this one away. At about the 21. What a throw for a big game. That is a great example of the quarterback seeing the whole field and finding the guy who had the best chance of making a catch. It's first and 10. Ball on the 21. He's tackled at the 20-yard line. Here's the eighth play of the series. Throws it out, and it falls incomplete. Boy, that was a rocket. If the receiver didn't come down with it, the quarterback made sure nobody else was going to come down with it either. Now it's third and nine coming up. Ball on the 20. They'll spread the field with five wide. And he's going to come up with a sack. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. Here comes the pressure. Fires out to his wide out, and he's tackled right around the 24-yard line. And they'll take over on downs. I don't think either team has a clear advantage so far. Let's see if they can make some plays and get a little separation. Got a man. Watch out here. He steps out at the 36. There's very good chemistry between these two. They like to run through all their routes before the game. And I have to say, they look sharp before this one even started. From their own 36-yard line, first down. Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. He's taken down at about the 45. The tight end's got it for a first down, and they make the stop at the 46-yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 46-yard line. And he's taken down around the 37-yard line. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. First and ten. 
Ball on the 32-yard line. And he makes it out to about the 31-yard line. They go with him again, and he'll be taken down behind the line. Well, the defensive line got such a good push up front that there was no one on the offense to account for the linebacker, and he got through almost untouched. And this play is number eight on the drive. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. Quick throw out to the receiver. It's going to be fourth and inches after that long pickup on third down. Boy, what a throw by the quarterback. Almost equally excellent catch by the receiver, but the defense topped them both by coming up with a stop. Gets out to about the 21. And this is the 10th play of the drive. They'll give it off here. Makes it out to maybe the 19-yard line. Second and eight coming up here. Ball on the 19-yard line. Sanders with the play fake, and he's tackled in the open field. So at the end of one quarter, no score here. Welcome back. Tight game here in the second quarter as we begin play. What a play to set him up with a first and goal. First and goal from the five, and looking to cap this off with a touchdown. Touchdown, Buffaloes! Colorado's been telling anybody that would listen that this kid really has what it takes to be a star, and he's always going to remember that first touchdown. I'm sure he's going to have a lot more. Great moment, though, for him and his family. He makes the PAT. Let's go to the studio for this Reese Davis update. The Huskies come into today's game ranked 15th in the nation. And for Washington, they're a heavy favorite. They're supposed to control the game, and they're doing exactly what's expected of them. And for Newton, he's barreled into the end zone for a touchdown. Washington leads it 14-10. All right, Reese, back to our game. Colorado is ready to kick it away. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. And he's level at the 28-yard line. It's second down, seven to go. Ball on their own 28. Taken down as he works the left for a nice game. They get about four on that keeper. Complete. He's got room. He goes out of bounds at the 36-yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 36-yard line. Got the corner. Good open field tackle.
Very well-designed play that time to give them a first down. The linemen executed their blocks nicely, and it went for a good game. From their own 46-yard line, it's first down. Now he tries to buy some time. They'll bring him down at the 44. And they'll get him in the backfield. Third down again. Looks to his receiver, first down, and down he goes around the 32-yard line. This guy's got the combination of smarts and reliability that makes a receiver really dangerous. No wonder he's looked to on third down. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 32. And he tackles him hard at the 19. 10th play of the drive. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. He fights forward to about the 16. From the 16-yard line, it's second down. Zips it right. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. We're at the 12th play of the drive. He's got it out to his tight end. Huge play, and it's going to be first and goal. A touchdown away from a tie. Runs through a defender, and he's in. This kid is a really reliable weapon. You definitely want the football in his hands near the end zone, and he showed you why right there. The extra point to tie this game up. He splits the uprights with the extra point. So a 13-play, 74-yard drive, and they put up seven points. We're even at seven in this one. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Tyson from the three. He's taken down at the 22. You always want to go in the locker room with momentum. So as we get closer to halftime, I think we'll see more and more attempts to create big plays. Fires quickly to the tight end, and he hits him hard at the 25. Second down, seven yards to go. Ball on their own 25. And he just gets rid of it. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. The quarterback in the gun with five receivers. Quick throw out to the receiver, incomplete. And this one could be on the defense. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. Anderson is back deep to return the punt. Booming kick. He makes it out to maybe the 43-yard line. 
This is the point in the game where you don't want to make any mistakes that give the other guys a reason to feel more confident going into halftime. And he's hit immediately. When you can move the ball downfield in big chunks like that, you've got the defense right where you want them. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 42-yard line. Fires quick out to the receiver, and he can't make the grab. Nice run there. Hot. Get seven yards on the play. Third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Tackle made at the 21-yard line. And he makes it out to about the 21-yard line. Picked up a yard of anything on that run. From the 21-yard line, second down. Tackled for a loss. The defense was in the backfield by the time he took the pitch. Great penetration. Fires it quickly. Fires quickly, and he's got his receiver for the touchdown. Great effort by the wide receiver. And not to take anything away from the quarterback, but the wide receiver made this play. One of the things a quarterback's looking for before the ball is snapped on a post route is to see if he has one safety in the middle of the field. Because with one safety, you can use your eyes to move that safety and then throw back the other way for the touchdown. And I thought the quarterback that time did a really good job of managing that safety and eventually making the throw for the touchdown. A quick update now. Here's Reese. A tussle going on in Tucson. This is a game we've been watching closely all day long. And for Washington, once again, this game just goes to show you never take anything for granted in college football. The Wildcats are on top, 20 to 14. Touchdown difference in this one, Reese, 14 7. California, ready to kick this one off. Tyson fields it at the two. He's to the 20. Makes it to the 22-yard line. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Pulls it in, and he's in the open field. What we're seeing right now is just a great connection between the quarterback and his receivers. They make these plays look effortless. From their own 40-yard line, first down. And a quick throw. He's knocked out of bounds right around the 46-yard line. Here's a run. And they make the stop at about the 45. That took a little too long to develop. Yeah, the offense was trying to get the pass rush going upfield, but the defense did a nice job of sniffing out the draw play and hitting them in the backfield. From their own 45-yard line, it's third down. Right 
Halfback's got it on the quick throw. That's a great tackle at the 48. Edwards gains around seven yards with a catch, and that's good for a first down. This quarterback still hasn't missed a receiver on this drive. They'll spread the field with five wide. He's scrambling. Brought down around the 48-yard line. At this point, boys, you're playing against the defense and the clock, so you might want to consider to hurry things up. From the 48-yard line, second down. Throws to the tight end, and that falls incomplete. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Slings it. He's tackled at the 28. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. Fires it out. He's taken down around the 18-yard line. The offense going to try to open this field up, coming out in a five-wide set. And the defense counters with their dime look. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. Touchdown, Colorado! And for Sanders, he's got 2,000 yards passing. Game in and game out, he has shown up and performed at a high level. His stats reflect that, and so does the respect he's earned from his opponents. Will be tied with the extra point. And he hits the PAT. So a nine-play, 76-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. We're deadlocked right now at 14. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The offense really came up with a nice drive there last time out, and most of those yards came through the air. This defense needs to improve from front to back. The line needs to put more pressure on the quarterback, and the defensive backs need to stick it to these receivers with tighter coverage. They're about four yards away here on second down. But I love the toughness here by this quarterback of sitting in until the last second, trying to make a play downfield, only to have this defense get to him. He's got to do a better job maybe feeling things out a little bit, but at least he has the awareness and a toughness to sit in that pocket. It falls incomplete. We played a half, 14 apiece. We've played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. These two defenses so far, they've been everything they've been advertised to be. They've stopped the run. They've limited the passing game. They apply pressure at the right times. It's going to be hard to find holes to move the ball at all in the second half. Yeah, and sometimes it's really bad offense, and sometimes you can also look at those holes, and they come open, and all of a sudden they close really fast. And, and that's what you're seeing. A lot of guys that are really athletic, really fast, they know where to be. A lot of guys that you'll be seeing playing on Sundays. I mean, it's just a lot of talent to overcome, and you got to be in the right position. But then you got to beat those great players that are also in the right position. So... I expect more of the same, but, you know, which team can break through it and make a huge play to, to take the other one, you know, off guard a little bit and, and make that big play. Looking forward to seeing this second half. I think there's certainly a want for victory. A want and a need for victory. Some teams need this victory, Reese Davis. Want, need, got to go get it either way. Brad and Kirk are there to deliver. All right, Reese, David, thanks, guys. Just about set to start the third quarter. Tyson takes it at the four. He's tackled at the 29. Time's getting a little bit tighter now. You got to make every possession count.
He makes his way to about the 38. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. He's going to try and scramble. And he's tackled around the 41 yard line. And he makes it out to about the 44 yard line. From their own 44 yard line. It's second down. Nice run, and he's brought down. level at the 39 yard line Anderson back to return it He puts it away, and it's a great kick. Gets to about the 27-yard line. I think it says something about the quality of the preparation of both teams that we're into the third quarter, and nobody's been able to pull away. Both sides seem to know what to expect. Trying to set up a little screen, gets it to his tailback. And he's taken down at the 48-yard line. First and ten. Ball on the 48-yard line. They go right, and he's tackled behind the line. Never really had a shot. They were on him almost as soon as he took the handoff. Run, left side. Nice run there as they work the outside. Third down now, and they need to get it down to the 38s. And they push him out right around the 32-yard line. He laterals. Tackle at the 23 yard line. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. They go with a counter, and he's hitting the backfield. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Inside the 10, and down he goes around the six-yard line. 
It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. The defense has got some of their best pass defenders on the field. They set up in the dime to counter that five wide receiver set. Hunter takes the give. Touchdown, Cal! It shouldn't have surprised these guys to see the run coming at them, but they just couldn't stop it. And he converts the extra point. California to kick. He'll take it from the two. He's to the 20. Tackle at the 24-yard line. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Fires quickly, and he's got his man. They'll bring him down around the 36-yard line. It's first and 10. Ball on the 36-yard line. Hand off to the left. Gets to about the 37-yard line. On the ground with the tailback. He gets out to about the 38-yard line. Here's third and eight. Ball on their own 38. Gets it out quickly. And he is drilled at the 44. He made the catch, but he didn't get the first down. Yeah, right now, the way this defense is swarming, there's just no room for him to get upfield for the first down. The defense has everybody on the line. I think they're going to come after this one. And down he goes at the 29-yard line. The last time out, they were able to pick up big chunks of yards through the air. You wonder if they'll go back to that same strategy or will they start to lean a little bit more on their ground game. Gets out to around the 38. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. California is up a score. Nice run there. Pretty good gain on the play by the halfback. And that shows you why he's such a weapon as a ball carrier. Good gain for the offense. Gets out to around the 45. Good solid running right there. Getting past the defensive lineman and into the secondary before he could be stopped. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 45-yard line. Up the middle for a nice game. Quick pass. Tackle made at the 33. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 33-yard line. They come out in a five-wide set. Gets out to about the 31. Fights forward to about the 29. So at the end of the third quarter, the Golden Bears lead 
back in this very pivotal fourth quarter. California is up by a touchdown. Here's the throw, and I don't think he got anything on that. Looks like they've decided to go for it here. Defense stiffens there and gives it back to their offense. Things aren't tied, but they might as well be. It's this drive that could really dictate the tone for the last quarter. He's got it out to his tight end. And they make the stop at the 33-yard line. From their own 33-yard line. Second down. And they got him. Sometimes it's just a relentless pass rush that results in a sack. And that's what happened there. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five wide outlook. Complete, and he's out of bounds. From their own 46-yard line, first down. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Man, did he play that perfectly or what? As a linebacker, you have to be able to read the offense and make a quick diagnosis, which is exactly what he did on that play. They give to the tailback. He fights forward to about the 43. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 44. Completes it, but he can't shake the defense. Green pass. He's got his half back. Steps out of bounds at about the 47-yard line. A score here might effectively end this one. California up seven points. Sends it out quick. Intercepted. He steps out at the 41-yard line. What is he thinking? The quarterback has got to know at this time in the game, unless his man is wide open, that he should just throw it away. It's these kinds of mistakes that can cost you a game. From their own 41-yard line, it's first down. And a quick throw brought down at the 46-yard line. Gets to about the 47-yard line. Third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. He's tackled at about the 45. That play was over before it got started. That was just a case of the offensive line getting beat at the snap of the ball. He 
He's taken down around the 47 yard line. From the 47 yard line. First down. He gets rid of this one. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. And he's going to come up with a sack. This quarterback has to do a better job of avoiding the rush because sacks can be real drive killers. Third down now, and they need to get it down to the 37. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. He flings it. Incomplete. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do a much better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions. And especially when the defense starts to get pressure, you've got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run with it. And he's tackled at the 23. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. California is up seven. He makes it to the 25-yard line. It's second down, eight to go. Ball on their own 25. it out maybe to the 26 yard line the Buffaloes taking their first time out of the half it's third and seven ball on the 26 they come out in an empty backfield makes the first down catch hauls it in as he's pushed out of bounds and they pick up the first down with a pass to the tight end. It's easy to forget about the tight end sometimes coming off the line. But you always have to watch this guy because he's certainly capable of making big plays. Fires incomplete. And there wasn't anyone in the vicinity. I think the ball just slipped out on him. From their own 38-yard line. Second down. And he's tackled around the 40-yard line. A two-yard run by the halfback. That's the senior safety that made that tackle. Great job of providing run support from the secondary. Quick throw to the tight end. And he's taken down around the 45-yard line. From the 45-yard line, first down. Just under two minutes in the game. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Here's the eighth play of the series. Tackled after a decent run up the gut. From the 34-yard line, it's first down. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. And he'll just take a knee here to kill the clock. Here's play number 10 on the drive.
This one's in the books. The Golden Bears with the victory. 21-14. For EA Sports and Kirk Herbstreit, this is Brad Nessler.